Hello everyone, FunshotX here. Welcome back to Material Energy Cubed, a Mac pack on the Feed the Beast launcher, created by Parcel, the winner of the Hardcore Quest mod map challenge. And we are in episode two. I just dug out this entire container of dirt, found a few more bone meal, and got me a sapling, or a oak tree. <laughs> and let's go ahead and chop this guy down. And that should be able to allow us to finish this next quest. We get a furnace generator, some bones, and we get uh, oak, spruce, or jungle. Uh, we already have oak and spruce from the chest in the dirt container, so let's get jungle. Now we have all different types of trees. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead and throw these all in here. Oops, need the torches. And see what the next quest reward or quest is. That is going to be well. We've got a bunch of choices here. Uh, we can go find Sea Biscuit. He's just in a, a little area. Um, you can kind of see him on the map. He's down that way. There's Sea Biscuit. That's hard to get to. Uh, the other thing we can do is uh, do these little turrets. And these are actually pretty quick, so I think I'm going to go ahead and do them. Let's get rid of this tree. It's in the way. Wish I had a hatchet. That would have been nice. But we'll do it the hard way. Punching trees. Same thing you do in all of Minecraft. When you don't have an axe. Alright. Alright. Uh, these should just despawn now. It's fine. Just let them go. Alright. So the first turret is the stone turret. It's accomplished by putting a uh, dispenser on top of a fence. There we go. This turret, I think, will attack mobs. Do you need to give it stuff? I don't think so. Alright. Uh, but for the quest, I actually have to kill it, <laughs> which is kind of sad, because um, there's no way for HQM to detect if you actually built one, so the only way it can know is if you kill one. Because if you kill one, you obviously built it, right? And he's going to die, and he gives us nothing. Oh, poor silly little turret. And I'm going to just go ahead and get rid of this, and this, clean out this area. This map is going to be very trying on the OCD in this because it's like this dirt container I could not leave the dirt in there I had to chop get rid of it all all right the next one is the crafting golem he's a little golem that follows you around a little crafting bench why is the music so loud oh oops that was sound that doesn't help huh let's go way down on sound there we go Okay, so crafting golem, we put a little skull on top of a crafting table. Uh, shift clicked. There you go. He is ugly. One ugly little guy. And I gotta kill him too. Sorry, little workbench golem. And you're dead. Uh, but I get the crafting table back. That's nice. And we'll take this with us. Uh, the last one is a bound soul. I don't think they do much on their own, but you can give them equipment. And then they can help you out. Just put a pumpkin on top of soul sand. There we go. And if we throw a sword at him, he's going to pick it up. No, you're not going to pick it up. Maybe I just click on you with it. There we go. Just right click on him with a sword and he's picked it up now. And now we're going to kill him. He won't kill us. Oh, we got a gold nugget out of it. Five gold, or five gold bars out of it. That's actually quite a bit. Cool. One thing is, uh, we could have used that pumpkin, I guess, for other purposes. Alright, do I still have that? No, I broke that block. Ah, oh, silly dirt block. Okay, I uh, need to eat some more sugar. I'm just going to live off sugar for the early part of this map. Is that a secret right up there? That might be. It's a little bit different than the rest. Um, or it might just be a block to prevent mobs from spawning. I don't know. So that should uh, allow us to claim all these rewards. We're going to get some more stuff to make more turrets. Turret manual, how to upgrade them. Uh, blocks, we can get some more skeleton skulls so we can create more crafting golems. And lastly, we'll get some soul sand, which we can't really do because we don't have any pumpkins. Oh well. <laughs> so let's get on out of here. And put, uh, yeah, just dump it all in here. I'll save the tutorial books for uh, to put in the other chest okay and the next thing we need to do is time to mine so we need some gold ore and 10 iron ore and I believe that is down Oop. oh man a little sugar speed boost is 
makes it hard. Let's go up and check that chest actually real quick. Or check that light. Let's grab some dirt. Let's see if there is anything up on top of this. Seems like a good place to hide stuff, right? Nope, just glowstone. Oh, there is a chest though. Cool. Whoa, there's the pink victory wool. Nice. I don't really need to bring the rest. We'll leave it there. Any of these blocks, carpenters? Yeah, they're all connected textures, so I don't think so. Oh well. Okay, there's probably one up there. And you can see I almost used this entire shovel to dig out all that dirt. <laughs> okay, so pink victory mole wool can go in there, and let's go ahead and go down here to where we will be mining. In here, we're going to find some pickaxes of various types and some ladders. Here's some more ladders, more pickaxes, and more torches. Cool. You are coming with me. Uh, can I reach you? There we go. Alright, these ladders are broken, they're not fully built, so let's just go ahead and go all the way down to the bottom and take a little damage and then build them back up. I really like these ladders, they're very quick. Oops. Uh, nope. <laughs> Sometimes a little too quick. No, don't put one over there. Oh man, is it going to take this long to break? Okay, that wasn't that bad. Okay, so here's the mine. We got lots of ores. We needed one gold, gold and a bunch of iron. I can hear more spiders. I'm sure they're in here. Well, I'm checking my map, and actually they're not. Looks like they're out to the left. And what is this? This is magnesium. A ton of metallurgy stuff down here. Magnesium, or metallurgy in the mod itself, I know very little about, so that's going to be fun to learn as we go. Here we get some phosphorite. Better light this up as we go. Uh, this was sulfur. Nice, we don't have two pulverized blaze rods to get it, it just gives it to us. Ah, forget the gold, we're looking for iron. And come back and get this. Here's my iron. There's the edge of the box, it appears. Okay. Oh yeah, here's a good this good deposit of iron. Should be able to finish the quest with this. Man, these mobs are not happy. <laughs> There's a lot of them. And I'm not going out to check on them. They can just be perfectly happy where they are. Oh, we got a little redstone over here. Cool. Might as well grab a little bit, just in case we need it for crafting something. Oh, and there's an emerald over here. Awesome. Oh, I wonder if we should get a fortune pick before we do the emeralds. Yeah, let's just do the things that give ore for now. Actually, it'll probably be a while before we get a fortune pick. Uh, yeah, yeah it's going to be a long time. Okay. Oh, diamonds. Ah, oh, I want to mine the diamonds. How do we get out of here? Back to our ladder. There we go. Okay, did we complete the quest? We did. Claim the reward. We get a reward bag, the biosphere, and five coins. Coins, by the way, are used in um, pay to win. So if we want a reward bag, just a basic one, we have to pay eight coins and then it goes up from there. So we have to do one, each one of these one time, so it, I mean I'm not going to do this repeatable quest, but I have to do it once just to unlock the others, so might as well turn in some coins. We don't have enough, but that's fine. Okay, next quest in here is to get uh, quartz and liquid coal, and we have to die, <laughs> and we need some fertilizer, and we need to go to the biosphere. Let's save Biosphere for the next episode. Let's work on some of these. Uh, I'm not going to do Seabiscuit right now. 
fertilizer. We need five fertilizer. And to craft that, we need uh, potash or nitre, some phosphorus, and magnesium. I've got the magnesium, I've got the phosphorus, and I got the potash. Cool. And we need just one of those. Might as well get a couple. We can use that instead of the bone meal, since we used all the bone meal pretty much. And claim that reward. We get melon. Nice. And we're done with that quest. That was easy. Um, death. Let's not die yet, if we can avoid it. <laughs> um, even more mining. Can submit those. I know we have them. We need to get more cobblestone, a ton more cobblestone, and one diamond. I know where that diamond is. It is over here. Let's put a torch there. Those mobs. Alright, here's the diamond. I'm hoping there's more somewhere. And then I just need to mine a bunch of cobble. So, I'm going to do a little speed up here and uh, get the cobble that I need. Be right back. And we're back guys we got all that cobble that was really easy um, after finding this chest here in the middle it gave me that mining potion which just let me go crazy it doesn't last very long so make sure you're ready to use it when you throw it uh, but yeah that that makes it super easy to get all the cobble you need for that quest let's go ahead and turn it in now uh, four diamonds so we get the diamonds back pretty much road bag oh two more super miners and miners delight nice okay Get up on out of here. I'll come back for more ore when I need it. But the next uh, quest reward will be, or quest challenge, we need the quartz. And we need liquid coal. Okay. Quartz is up here. We saw that on the way in. And if we can find it. Is this all quartz? Yeah, that's chiseled quartz. I could probably use it too. But this is all quartz as well. Oop, maybe I didn't want to break those ones. <laughs> here, let's put those ones back. Now let's put a chest temporarily here to drop a bunch of junk. Yeah, we'll leave those ones there so we're not opening that. Uh, let's waste up this Electrum pick next. Oh, little quest, a chest. A basic reward bag, piece of crap. <laughs> There's the OCD right there. I have to put those blocks back. Even <laughs> Can't have that little empty space there. That would not be good. Okay, so now I should be able to uncraft this back into Surtis Quartz and turn it in. Oh, we're only 54%, so we need a little bit more... Just do these extra ones here that don't have glowstone on top of them. Almost there. Might take all of them. It's definitely an interesting map. Instead of, you know, creating things with uh, uh, Exclu Hilo or whatever, you're finding it in the world and making use of it. Oh, phone's going off. There, we're back. back. Okay. 92%. Oh, man, I'm going to have to mine some of these. Okay. You like a, look like a good candidate. Nope, you are not a good candidate, Nick. Well, that uh, might just be a quick way down there. <laughs> All right. Is that enough? How much more do we need? 16. Exactly enough. Oh, perfect. So, we're going to get a coin, reward bag, a carpenter's bed, and we either get a helmet or boots. Uh, I don't have either. So let's get uh, boots, helmet, I don't know, yeah, helmet. Uh, I don't have enough space, maybe? Yeah. 
There we go. Put that helmet on. Ooh, cool. <laughs> and let's do some quest rewards. This one had... Whoa! Storage upgrades! Redstone upgrade? I don't even know what that does. Allow the barrel to emit redstone. Okay, well that makes sense. Redstone facade. And a beast space barrel. Well, that's just cool. I... I don't know enough about Jabba, I guess. I haven't... I, you know, I make Jabba barrels, but I don't get into those upgrades much other than just making storage bigger. This one... Ooh, nice! I just got a helm, so I don't need that. Copper chest plate. Oh, I picked the right thing, guys. Because <laughs> it gave me everything but the helm. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like, uh... Looks like a female outfit from WoW, you know. Just doesn't cover everything. But we also got a copper shovel and a copper hoe. Cool. This one, 20 coal, 5 dispensers, and a resident ender bucket, ender pearl, and ender generator. Nice! That's pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, so much junk in the inventory. I think in between episodes I'll actually come back and move all these chests back up to the top. Alright, and is there anything left to do before we head off to the biosphere? Let's go find that liquid coal. Do we finish this one? Yes, we did. Yeah. Liquid coal. I think I know where that is. That was in one of those chests that we found very early on. Oop, jump. I think it was in the strong box here. There they are. Look affected coal. How much of it did I need? Three buckets. One, two, three. There we go. Claim some coal, some pulverized coal, and a reward bag. Do I have the space for it? Nope. So let's just go put them back. <laughs> Looks like it just wanted you to find them and then store them again. Why aren't these florbs stacking? That was weird. Okay. A junk chest here. Oops, no, that's not junk. Yeah, really, just put everything in here. <laughs> okay, so we can now claim this reward. We'll check what's in the bag. We've got Emmy interface, a melon, cable, transition plane. So it looks like everything we need to set up an automated melon farm with Emmy. We'll definitely be doing that. That sounds like a good idea. And we've got some more coins, so we might as well go submit the pay to win. Finish that guy off. Claim a bag, and now we opened up the larger bag, which takes five stacks of coins. <laughs> okay. And we got another Master Rod with Silk Touch on it. Cool. Enthusiastic. Yay. <laughs> um, and then I think the only other thing we need to do is die, right? There's something there. I don't know how to unlock that one. Alright, so you've died zero of two times. I have to die twice. And I'll get a diamond nook. Okay, that seems silly. Um, five diamond coins, a heart, and a reward bag. I don't know what you can do with a diamond nook. You put tunics together to make a corner. Two of those. Yeah, you'd only get a pillar. I need to be more. All right, well, I think I'm just going to complete that quest as I die, because I think I'm going to die anyway, right? Exploring the biosphere, maybe? So I think we'll just leave that one there. And that'll be the end of this episode. This has been Funshine X for Material Energy Cubed. If you liked the episode, hit the like button. Pretty easy. And if you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. It's free. Until next time, bye, guys.